welcome to your visible culture. From the studios of Portland Cable Access, we bring you another in our series of Portland Poets. Mark Sargent and Greg Van Warmer are members of Defenstration, and they make it their work to rebuild the classic dualism in poetry between music and words. In this presentation, dedicated to Julian Beck, they will perform Apple Maggot Quarantine Zone. Let's watch and listen to the music and the words of Mark Sargent and Greg Van Warmer. <laughs> of impulse, durable, constellated, luminous details. Here error is all the not done, all in the diffidence that faltered. So, 
in the back of a pickup, flushed with the end of work, air cleaner still than this October day, electric, done with the summer's labor, roaring into town, drowned in amplified oompa blare, and the smell of hot sausage and chicken, loaded, six weeks pay in cash and dirty, thirsty for a night without warning. Without a goddamn cock flaring at the first shard of sun. Just hairy and hungry for the company of the kindred, lost, loaded, and stinking of hops. Anna Mandietta, 35, Cuban born sculptor who worked with natural forms such as tree stumps and earth mounds of injuries, dead, when she fell from the 34th floor apartment in New York City. Her husband of nine months, Carl Andre, 50, a controversial pioneering minimalist whose work often consists of lines of bricks and blocks of wood was arrested and charged with pushing her out the window during an argument. He was released two days later on $250,000 cash bail after a judge refused an offer for Andre's attorney a $500,000 worth of art. Don't pay the poet. Don't feed the monkey. Don't accept art in lieu of cash. <laughs> ancestral memory, gurgling uselessly in the genes. A 
a tribe perhaps that cannot survive its instincts. Yeah, dark blue, tonal nuance. The sounds pile up relationships. Voices bang, big value over the act of speech, over movement of membrane and diaphragm. Squeak to bellow. A tribe, a tribe, a tribe perhaps that cannot survive its language. Yeah, Dave. Dog grew. To remember its brains in the past. Reorder previous engagement, frame thing into totem, effigiate enemies, spray gray and lustrous color. Dog boo, he waits behind the dark, in the door, to scare. Dog clue, a tribe perhaps, a tribe perhaps, they cannot survive his language. Love in this time, now it is surrender. Give up. If you want to have any discovery, surrender. This totality, birth, love, and death, give up. All other wheels, the axis of desire has crashed. The axis of desire has crashed. Image is no good, no good, no good. There isn't anything left. Give up, surrender. There is no science, nothing. Nothing, nothing to be clung to. Nothing works. Everything's perfect. Nothing works. Nothing works. Works, he said. He said, we realize, realize death and the state of being born, of just being born, of just being born. The speaking past is heaven, born in the air, without wings or steerage, but wrapped in flesh, useless against the cold, the way it is for everyone. So no sweat, no toys with a he head spit off. Hardly, just spitting on sidewalks in wrong towns. Beer coasters and a map of the world you've been in. I've seen you there, and you, you were out looking out for someone to help harvest the shadows growing from the pavement, and oops, wrong town, wrong profession, wrong woman, again. You cannot disperse yourself or but one dot on the map. No matter how fast you blur the ground, no matter the dust raised in your wake, one dot, one speck, one bit of bleeding matter. Looking, then, and then the rope broke. And then, and then the rope broke, the rope broke. Never trading, never trading, never trading, trading never. The insurance of choice, the insurance of choice, the insurance before the terrorism of the army of God, the terrorism, the terrorism, the terrorism of the army of God. March 16th, Ladies' Choice Clinic, St. Petersburg, Florida, explosives. March 26th, Everett Feminist Women's Health Center, Everett, Washington, arson. May 12th, Boers Birth and Health Center. Surgery Center, Forest Grove, bombing, two arson attempts. June 25th, Lady Center, Pensacola, Florida, dynamite. July 4th, Planned Parenthood, Annapolis, Maryland, bombing. August 20th, Cy Fair Clinic, Houston, Molotov cocktail. September 9th, Clear Lake Women's Center, Webster, Texas, fire bombing. September 20th, Planned Parenthood, Marietta, Georgia, fire bombing. November 19th, Metropolitan Medical and Women's Center, Wheaton, Maryland, bombing. December 25th, Ladies Clinic, Pensacola, Florida, bombing. December 25th, Dr. Permitter's office, Pensacola, Florida, bombing. December 25th, Dr. Bo Bogenholm's office, Pensacola, Florida, bombing, bombing, arson, bombing. Feminist Women's Health Center, Los Angeles, California, arson, bombing. And the day 
after her birth, her birth, somehow, after her birth, somehow, somehow, somehow she was spared, she was spared when the roof fell in, naked, hairless, as delicate as living allows, the concrete floors collapsed, the machinery crumbled, air tense with dust and death, her bones of rubber, skull the consistency of a ripe tomato, for six days beneath tons of twisted steel and concrete, six days at the breast of its dead mother absorbing the heat, survived, survived, on excess fat and water, six days in a hibernation, beneath the rubble of a hospital, moving little, moving little at the breast of its dead mother, moving little, conserving energy, awaiting rebirth, awaiting rebirth, rebirth, in the light, awaiting There is no reason to remember, but it is imperative. The lessons are described. How to survive America. How to calculate the effect of action. How to act without calculation. How the serum of compassion clots with desire. How all choices arrive empty in heaven on earth. In heaven on earth, we work towards the core of life, there to alter the source to make red hair with blue eyes and fingernails that never break, strong hands, hearts that will never seize or break or in any way mispump in heaven on earth. All choices, all choices arrive, all choices arrive empty. shave our bodies, shave our bodies to be nothing, nothing, nothing in 80 feet of space. It has to do, it has to do with going beyond, going beyond being human, beyond being human, beyond being human in 80 feet of space, beneath tons of concrete and steel, the rope broke into a crash of rebirth beyond the possible.
upon the earth, all the way to heaven. That's how you get there. You need a semen mixer. Just turning up the stuff. If you want to get to heaven. Electricity smashing against the boundaries of my home. I break too break against the walls of the future. Look right there. Look right there. Look again. Look right there. Look again. Things are going flat. Things are going flat. Interchangeable. Birth. Death. Interchangeable. Death. And birth. Interchangeable. Interchangeable. Look right there. Look again. Things are going flat. Interchangeable. Do less with more. Do less with more. Do less with more. Take a handful of water. Make something everyone loves. Exchange it. Look right there. Look again. Things are growing flat. Interchangeable. Do less with more. Make birth and death optional. 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 says keep on eating the doctor says spread your legs and scoot down on the table the doctor says listen to the heartbeat if the fine structure constant had quirked instead of quirked if the billions of random events 10 raised to the 55th power had wavered for a moment had blinked if order had been applied to the chaos then we are dispersed from the cores of stars in supernova explosions and pierce the experimental chemistry of space with a germ, a transmission that sets in wave, a wave of mutation to... When his hand felt the air around her, the texture of her aroma, an archaeology 
finding one's way in a history identified in a moment with that star dying in brilliance a million years of light two times what two times what a ten drachma coin with a nuclear symbol on it the old with the oldest engraved with certainty on a useless unit of measure if you love this planet you have to give something away you have to name the cycle of creation back to an echo boomerang and you follow the muscle of flight curving out in spirals to the apex of absolute zero where it turns to return a fish with its tail flapping attacking desperate and certain the core of that star and the doctor says listen to the heartbeat why einstein believed in god nothing 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 could have easily happened no bookie would have ever taken the action the equations exist nobody understands how the equations exist nobody understand knows why one over 137 defines the physical model the equations exist nobody understands how within a spectrum of infinities the crash and explosion of star everything could sink perfectly to these tears as i reach out with my imperfect hands and she says feel the heartbeat history, a twisted mammal passage, chunks of breathing placed end to end, a blip of time twisted out of meaning, the species are at with hands that work, memory instead of instinct, the left hand of the moon, right wing of love, silver birds perch on their tails in a rough rain going soft. This place where I stand, where the colors of this geography has something to burn. You step into the air, strange to the earth, and age a thousand years to the touch. And they are sleeping, the two of them together. He out of her, his head and hand on her breast, legs curled up on her stomach. She has her head back against the pillows, one hand cupping his little butt, and they are both so deep in peace that their sleeping air, two breaths to her one, expands and contracts the walls of the room as tropical vegetation in a hot midday breeze. I kiss them as lightly as I can, not to wake, but to gently enter their dreams with my lips. Join, if only briefly, their complete and total union. She is much younger in sleep. A soft girl mother and he, he is at the moment of birth. A reoccurring miracle, a pure, an absolute demand that I confirm 
All belief with action. He is a truth beyond logic. And she is the bearer of the word. We have no money. I have no job. I doubt that all these years of voluntary poverty have prepared me for the real thing. I am the luckiest man in the world. And we live exactly as we want. Together in love. Through the language.